What is up guys, the real Damon Jackson here, and uh, I'm sorry I haven't been active in a while, I've been trying to um, plan some new experiments. So what I have here is something that I haven't really seen too much of on YouTube, and um, so if you can, well, if you can predict what's going to happen, well actually you can, because you know in the future there's going to be a title, but Right here, I have charcoal that I ground up, and I have magnesium, and I have um, magnetite that I got from the ground using magnets. It's very fine. And I also have this aluminum thing that I made that's kind of like a crucible and sitting on a rock. So you can tell that this is magnetite because I have my magnet on it. It's in a pill bottle. I don't know where you guys live, but... <laughs> Um, here pill bottles are actually really common to store places, store things in. So, uh, I need my stand. I need my stand for my phone so that I can record this. But basically what's going to happen, hopefully this is the plan. I have charcoal on my fingers. But I'm going to, um, th that's essentially iron oxide. So I'm going to try to mix it with this charcoal and then I'm going to burn them together using the very hot flame of this magnesium and hopefully I'll get metallic iron out of it because um, it should burn hot enough to thermally decompose this iron oxide, you know, to rip, to rip the iron for, or <laughs> to rip the oxygen out of it. And while the oxygen is free, it should absorb into this charcoal making CO2 so that it can't go back into the it can't recombine with the iron basically so I think the way they normally do this is with blast furnaces I haven't looked too much into it and I don't have one of those so I think the heat from the magnesium is gonna have to do hopefully I've never done this like I said there's not much I could watch on YouTube about it either so I guess I'll just hope for the best. I think it'll work. Should. Okay, I found my stand. Uh, this is kind of a weird angle, so I'm gonna leave it at this when I light it, and then I'm going to first. I mean, I gotta mix it. I don't know how much um to mix, so I'll have this on camera. I'm just opening the pill bottle. Is the magnet away from it? Yeah, my magnet's away. You don't want to really get the magnet near it, because then it's a pain to get off your magnet. So. I'm just going to pour out Okay, that that might be a little bit too much. Pouring it out. Okay. So, I'll lift it up so you can see. Okay, there's there's the magnetite. So now, I was going to originally do this with no charcoal, but I figured charcoal was obviously a better idea. There. Now it's all together. <clears throat> now I just got to mix it. There we go. That's that looks like a healthy mixture. I don't know if that's enough. Um, cause I didn't. Okay. So there it is. I, I was looking all over the place, but it was really on the ground. My my um magnesium ribbon. So now I'm gonna rip a little piece of this ribbon off. Little meaning medium sized. Oh, there's a compound on it. I don't know. Wow, there's actually a lot of it. That is not gonna. Crap. Okay, let me get this together. Um, 
I'll be back in a second. I'm gonna just move this around a little bit. Okay, I have it all set up. I think this is gonna work. Okay, so the heat from this should travel down there and basically um, thermally decompose the iron oxide into a um, detectable iron with a magnet. I don't know. Star, she blows. And I'm not sure if I got a solid chunk out of that. Okay, now I'm going to take my magnet. I'm gonna... Okay, this is gonna be the difficult part. This is not thought out well. Okay. Take my magnet. Um, I'll just put these for now. Okay, so here's what we have. And I use the use the magnet to lift this out. So, what I'm gonna do now is try and sift through this. Is that iron right there? That's magnesium. Did it actually work? If this actually worked, I'm going to be so happy. Mm. Got to remember to keep it in the camera. So... Put this over here. This is the piece. Oh. Oh my gosh, guys. I think that is our piece of iron. Maybe. Hmm. Because as you can see, if I grab this magnesium, it does not get affected by the magnetic field. So, we know that this bigger piece of stuff must have iron in it. I think it absolutely does. Wow.
either that or I just melted the magnetite together, but I don't think so, because that was pretty intense, and I saw a faint, like, sparking. And that white stuff is not really falling off, so I think that I did successfully thermally decompose magnetite that I got from the ground into metallic iron um what do you guys think tell me in the comments because i would really like to hear some kind of input on this topic because um i got nothing because i don't really have any sources there's like there's a uh, ancient Oh, see how that, see how the, the white solid, like, follows it? It's magnetic, too. But, um, I guess there was some kind of Japanese furnace that did the same thing. Kind of turned magnetite from the earth into, into iron or steel. And I think that'd be really interesting to actually figure out how to do, like, reliably. Or maybe I just need... I just need more of everything. Anyways, uh, this was the first trial. If you guys let me know how to actually do this right, then I could try it again. Because I have more magnetite and I have more charcoal. And I have a lot more magnesium ribbon. So, watch, like, comment, and subscribe. Please comment on this video. Comment, you know, it means, means the world to me too know that somebody's watching and is giving their input so with that being said i will see you in the next video